The latest studies show that the novel coronavirus can live on some surfaces for several days. Because of that, public health officials recommend the routine disinfection of your personal space. What's the best way to do it, and which surfaces should you target? Formosa News reporter Stephanie Yang asked the experts on how to safely and effectively sanitize your space. The CDC has specific instructions when it comes to disinfecting areas. These steps can help reduce the risk of contracting COVID-19. The Taiwan CDC recommends cleaning and disinfecting things that we frequently touch. That includes doorknobs, keyboards, phones, light switches, faucets, toilets, sinks, remotes, and children's toys. A cleaning expert says there are a few things to keep in mind when cleaning and disinfecting. For example, spray the product on the cloth first, not on the object you're cleaning. The cloth you use must be clean. The other thing is that the alcohol must not be directly sprayed onto the object. The product must first be sprayed onto the towel or cloth first. Don't wipe the cloth on the same surface over and over. Spray the alcohol on the cloth and then clean the surface in one sweeping motion. That's the way to remove the germs. What solution should you use for disinfection? There are many commercial cleaning products available on the market. But what if you can't find any at your local grocery store due to panic buying? The Taiwan CDC says homemade solutions of alcohol or bleach can be effective. According to the CDC, you can prepare a 0.05% bleach solution by mixing 10 liters of water with 100 cc of bleach, which is about 5 tablespoons. A solution of 70% alcohol also works. If you can't find cleaning products, we can use alcohol. We can buy alcohol that is approximately 85 percent, diluted to about 70 to 78 percent. This is the concentration of alcohol needed for effective disinfection. Experts say it's also important to clean your phone. The smartphone brand Apple advises using only a soft, lint-free cloth to clean screens. Don't use towels, paper towels, or any fabric that's abrasive. To clean phone screens, we use a soft cloth, such as the cloth used to clean eyeglasses. Spray the solution onto the cloth and then wipe it. When cleaning a leather wallet, do the same thing. Remember to use a leather care liquid to protect it. The expert also emphasizes the importance of discarding your face mask correctly. Once you're done using a mask, fold it up, place it in a plastic bag, and then discard it into the trash can. The Ministry of Health and Welfare says that face mask littering is subject to a fine between 1,200 NT and 6,000 NT, according to the Waste Disposal Act. Vigilant disinfection and proper face mask disposal are all ways to combat the spread of the coronavirus. But experts say the most important thing to do is to wash your hands thoroughly and often. Experts say to wash your hands with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. For most of news, Stephanie Yang, Zhang Tingxiang in Taipei.